YouTube, this is your boy Ice Cream Man. And I'm back in with another video. Um, it sucks because I had uh, I'm keep getting fucking interrupted, but it, it it doesn't matter anymore, right? Um man, let's just talk about this the the this thing that is going around, um, especially around the Tampa Bay Buccaneers fan base right now. And uh I just wanna talk about this because I'm you know, I'm I'm actually following this um, NFC South uh, Elite Group page, and uh, this one guy posted something very interesting about how the Tampa Bay Buccaneers at the moment feel that they was very targeted by P.J. Williams, and he is definitely the most wanted player on our team that the fan base of the, of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers um, just doesn't like like they have it out for this guy as in pure hatred right now. And from from a Saints fan, we should know a thing about not liking a player or not liking a team. We can name several teams: Forty Niners, Vernon Davis, Seahawks, Beast Mode, Rams. No call. You you see what I'm getting at here. We have our favor, uh, have our moments where we kind of just despise a team, and don't forget about the Atlanta Falcons. They didn't they haven't really did too much to us, but you know we just fans just really don't like each other like that. But uh, for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, you know. Their fan base really feel like they really feel that PJ Williams is really targeting their players that last um, met up for the second time. And if you look at the thing that PJ Williams did, he sealed the deal the first time that we met, thirty-eight to three or whatever the score was. It was just a blowout. That's when Jameis got hurt that game. Then the second time we played, 9-0. to zero. P.J. Williams, I believe, hurt it two of their men. Okay? And then we got CCJ, Chris Gardner-Johnson. He hurt, uh, not hurt anyone, I don't believe so, but the guy's a troll, man. The guy was just trolling the GOAT, Tom Brady, and trolling uh, the fans like this Saints team is really being the most hated right now. Um, for some reason, the Tampa Bay fan base really thinking that the Saints players is really targeting, um, you know, their offensive weapons. And it's kind of crazy, you know, but that's just the way how they're feeling right now. Like, they really feel um, they like they is having an alpha P.J. Williams. They is disgusted. They is unhappy and they just don't like the guy at the moment but that's okay because every NFL team every NFL team and every fan base have a specific team that they just don't like and PJ Williams uh, he is the most wanted guy right now even some sports analysts don't like the guy because somehow he blew the chances of the GOAT in his MVP race that Tom Brady is having with him and um, that Teller running back guy and also the Aaron Rodgers. So the Saints defense kind of screwed Tom Brady up that. And on top of that, we took away three of their weapons, um, not intentionally, but they that's what they feel. So uh, I could definitely say P.J. Williams have a target on his back if we ever meet in the playoffs, which I don't think so. But P.J. Williams at the moment right now is the most wanted guy. And that's interesting because we all have 
those sets of teams and player that used to play for the team. We just don't like, like uh, the Minnesota Vikings. They don't like the Saints for no reason. And they truly believe that we cheated. So what I want to ask the Minnesota Vikings is, is this. And yes, I was scratching my nose when I say this. How the hell is our fault that we lost? I mean, that y'all lost in that NFC Conference Championship game back in 09 or 10, or was it 010 or 11? Ah, that was 09 or 10. <sighs> yeah, 09 or 10. How the hell that we cheated y'all? How did we hurt y'all? When Brett Fall was the one that threw that, um, I don't know what kind of pass right into Tracy Porter hand, but for some reason we did y'all something. It just like the Seattle and um, Seattle and um, um, the Patriots uh, uh, when Seattle instead of running the ball with Beast Mode, Seattle threw it right into Malcolm Butler hand. Y'all expect Seattle to hate the Patriots for it? No, that was just a dumbass play call and a dumbass fucking throw. But the Vikings, they most of them do not like the Saints whatsoever. But like I say, every team have a most wanted team that they just don't like, whether if it's a, a, a division rival or just some team that they just don't like. But at the moment, P.J. Williams, he is that most wanted guy. It is what it is, P.J. Williams. You better watch your back, man. Tampa Bay Buccaneers fans that might throw some rocks at your door or bust your car window, you have to watch your back, man. That's all I'm going to say. Who that?